When we think of Rod Wood, good memories, no, great memories come so easily. And while remembering our colleague and friend who passed away late Sunday night, someone who has a mountain of them shared the anchor desk with Rod for three decades. We want to say hello to Carrie. Carrie, this is so difficult. It's shocking to think of this world without Rod. I mean, he was so many things to so many people. He loved Syracuse and Central New York. He was so devoted to the community, of course, to his wife and his five children and his family at News Channel 9. And of course, those of us who really were dear, dear friends with him were just so fortunate. And, you know, he, he was a larger than life person, not just because he was on the news, but because he had this amazing heart and this generous spirit. And uh, yeah, it's just, it's really hard to let this sink in. It really is. Uh, you know, so many great moments, so many great memories. Maybe you can share a favorite. We had so many big stories that we covered together and we, we had this front row seat to history that we shared. And so we started out, he was a mentor, then we became partners, and then just so, such close friends, you know? He's known my girls since they were born. Uh, he was crazy about my husband, Dave. How, how's Dave? How's Dave? He'd always bring presents for Dave and come over to the house with, with big things of Paul DeLima coffee because he knew we liked dark roast. And, you know, just he would show up at all these sort of crazy hours and it was always great to see him. Always so, great. I have similar yeah. experiences and memories. He had an amazing sense of humor and you know our viewers would see it occasionally when he would go into you know one of his impersonations or but he always knew the right time to get you laughing and in a newsroom where you know there are a lot of heavy days um, he just always knew how to keep it light and, and just um, how, to, how to get you to relax and, and realize that this was just part of the job and that we were human beings with all kinds of emotions, but Rod was going to get you to smile. I saw him last week. Um, we had a really nice visit and, you know, he wanted to know the latest gossip. What's Dan going to do when he's, he retires? I can't get it out of him. What's he going to do? <laughs> you know, and just... Just Rod, you know, being just funny. Rod being and Rod, yeah. Just being Rod. And, and so we laughed and told some old stories. And then when I got in the car, believe it or not, um, Barbara Streisand, The Way We Were, was playing. And uh, I was listening to the song, and of course I started to cry. And, and then there's one part when she said, so it's the laughter we will remember whenever we remember the way we were. And I thought, that's good advice, because that's the way Rod would like to be remembered for making us smile and that great smile of his. So we love you, Rod. Only one like you never will be. You're a legend. You're a legend to all of us who knew you. Yes, our Rod.